The Swifties are seeking revenge. The supposed leaks of Taylor Swift's upcoming album, The Tortured Poets Department, which is scheduled for release on Friday, sent her fans into a frenzy on Wednesday. The Daily Mail claims that the excerpts were pulled from a Google Drive link that included 17 different songs. The 34-year-old Swift had previously stated that there would be that many tracks on her 11th studio album. Regarding whether the songs were produced by artificial intelligence or were genuine, the Grammy winner's fan base was split. Some persuaded the genuine Swifties not to listen to them and to report the leaks. For more, my love, on page 6. Tip! For the next 24 hours, turn off the entire volume on your device when using Twitter and report every post that mentions album leaks. One devoted follower tweeted, We got this. A Taylor Swift album release wouldn't be the same without phony. Swifties. Leaking leaks because they can't wait to hear the album one day. It's pathetic. Someone else remarked. Please refrain from disseminating the Taylor Swift new album leak. Keep in mind that you should treat Taylor's work with the same respect as you do your favorite musician. A third commenter said, Don't hold the musician accountable for the actions of their fans. Swift's representative was contacted by Page Six for comment, but they did not respond right away. Swift collaborated with Spotify for a unique library installation at the Grove in Los Angeles ahead of her highly anticipated album's release this Friday. A number of Easter eggs about her next project were present throughout the display, such as an open book with a phrase, One less temptress, leave one dagger unhoned, and even statues break if forced to wait. It was during the 2024 Grammy Awards when the vocalist of Cruel Summer revealed the record to the public introducing the Tortured Poets Department to the world. April 19th is when my brand new album releases. The Tortured Poets Department is what it's called. She remarked as she accepted the Grammy for Best Pop Singing Album. The moniker of the project seems to be a dark parody of the boys-only group text that Joe Alwyn, Swift's ex-boyfriend, had with his buddies Paul Mescal and Andrew Scott, which they called the The Tortured Man Club. The words, even statues crumble slash if they're made to wait, seem to refer to the 33-year-old conversations with friends, actor that the pop singer dated for more than six years, according to her fans.